Morning everyone, how are you? It's another Tokyo Tuesday and it's another haul. <sighs> I love me some hauls. And today it's a Universal Studios Japan haul. If you love haul videos, you'll love this. If you're not into hauls, click off. This won't be the video for you because it's all about the beautiful things I bought in Japan. Thanks so much. Join me on the side of the intro and let's start. Hit it, maestro. And I was so excited. Look, <laughs> I'm Ravenclaw. I always thought I'd be Slytherin, but I'm not. I'm Ra Ravenclaw, and I don't really understand that. But I did the test, and I'm definitely Ravenclaw. Um, and these, these are fabulous. Um, I also got, oh, it's the wrong way around. I also got a Slytherin one. Um, Savannah Slytherin. Whether she'll ever wear this or not, I don't know. If she doesn't, it'll end up in a giveaway. Everything I'm giving her has ended up in a giveaway because she doesn't want them. Um, but what's really great is this actually comes out. So you've got the headband or you just clip this through. You could just have it as a bow in your hair and you can have it on your headband. And I hadn't seen these. So I got her the Slytherin one. But what I also did, because I don't forget you, I got a pair of Gryffindor, which are sort of the universal pair, aren't they? Um, so that's for a giveaway. So that would be for a future giveaway, um, the Universal Studios one. So those are those. And they are two and a half thousand yen. So they're about, what, $23, so about £18. But I thought these were fabulous. So that's in a future giveaway. I need a bag, don't I, for my Universal Studios giveaway. So that'll be in there. Savannah just come in and brought me a cup of tea. <laughs> Cheers, everyone. Ah, that's nice. Right, so, now you see my ears. I do like these. I'm ever so pleased. I was so excited. And look, what if they've got them in Florida and I've missed them? But I hadn't seen them before and I was like, oh, gotta buy them. My bag, it's not as big as the other bags. I was better. I was better. It was hard, but I was better. Right, we were on a train. There's only so much you can carry back on a train, especially when, oh my word, when you see our travel video to Universal, it was so funny, the first leg on the train. You know when you go to get on a train and there's actually no room for you to physically get on a train and you get on and then you're pushed further and further back and then you've got three, four rows of people in front of you like, that's what it was like. It's hilarious. So yeah, I've done that to try and help someone who's planning on going and uh, yeah. It's like um, a fool's guide of how to get to Tokyo from uh, Universal from Disneyland, so yeah. So I should look at what I'm putting out before I pull them out. We were given some little stickers, Easter stickers when we were over there, Minion Easter stickers. And the best team, we had some photos, we had a photo done, which is in the first bag. So let's have a look. And even though you take your own, you, you, you have photos done, don't you? Oh, this one was actually in Jaws, and we love this. Um, they've still got the Jaws ride in Universal Japan. Can you believe it? Look at that. How fab is that? And look, it's like 3D rubber effect. And um, yeah, we saw that, and we just, I had to buy that. How fab is that? I really, really love that. Hide my face. So, yeah, great video. And that was the 29th of May, so that was the day after my birthday. Um, yeah, fabulous. They wouldn't let me actually film on the ride. I was gutted. Um, I think the trick is, don't get your camera out before the ride started and then you can get away with murder. Um, but because I was at the front of the boat, she wasn't having any of it. And so I couldn't actually record it. So I was a bit disappointed with that so yeah so that's my picture right look at these <laughs> oh 
Oh, aren't these fabulous? These were 2300 yen, so about $20, about £16, but the actual Hello Kitty ears from Japan. Fabulous, and they are going in my haul. That's going in my um, giveaway, sorry. So that'll be in a future giveaway. They will definitely be in that. So that was my plan with those. I've lost my bag. So, yeah, you can't go to Japan and not buy anything Hello Kitty, can you? So there's that. What else have we got in here? What else did I buy? Oh, okay. I think I got 10. Did I get 10 or 12? I think I got 12. The mystery pins. Mystery, universal mystery pins. And look, those are all the ones on the back. So those are all the options on the back. I haven't seen these before again. There's 10 and I've got 12 boxes, so they will be in a future unboxing video. And these were 800 yen each, so about $7 a pin, about five pounds, but uh, a set of 10. So we'll see if I can do it. And I was taking them, they were all on one shelf and I was taking them from the front, from the back and Phil was watching me thinking, she's lost it. She's really, really lost. She really, really has. <laughs> so, so yeah, I've got those. What else? Okay, what else did we get? Oh, we got a t-shirt. Okay. So this is the Jaws one. Well, look. And it's in Japan. In Japanese, sorry, underneath. So we had to get Phil this. Obviously, the Jaws ride in Disney World has, uh, sorry, in Universal, Florida has now gone. So to be able to ride it in Tokyo was utterly amazing. So he had that one. Um, yeah, I didn't find any t-shirts for me in the universe. It was really, really disappointing. Um, then he had, we didn't have a chance to go on it. We only had seven hours there because it was four and a half hours there and four hours back. So it was a long journey, but we got seven hours in the park, but it wasn't enough. It wasn't enough. We needed to be there from opening until close and we still wouldn't have had enough. The plan is next time to go for one or two overnights, so we've got two or three days. But look, Jurassic Park in Japanese. How oh, fab. Oh, I really love these. Um, and this was 3,600 yen, so about mm, 34, 35, so about 30 pounds. So really like that. And it, you know, it's something different. Um, we wanted to get t-shirts that you couldn't really get anywhere else because it's so special to be able to go there. So those. What else in my bag of tricks? Got some fridge magnets. Um, I, they probably do these in Disney World. I haven't seen them before. These are one and a half thousand yen. So about $13, about 10 pounds. But it's a full house. because when we all done the test, Savannah Slytherin, I'm Ravenclaw. Blake's Gryffindor and Phil's Hufflepuff. Um, so I just thought that was great to put on the fridge. Um, so yeah, so that can come out of its packaging now. Packaging on the floor. Next thing, what else have we got? Oh, Blake's gonna love these. Right, this was 2,000 yen and it's filled with mini, mini frogs. So you know the chocolate frog is one big massive one. This is mini frogs. Um, and we just thought that that was lovely. What a lovely box, it's a tin. Really lovely. And we just thought that was something quite special. So yeah, got in that. And that was 2000 yen, so about $18. About what, 13, 14 pounds. So we got him that. We got these, these are going in my giveaway. Um, and that's a box of chocolates and they're good until the 12th of August so I've got to do those before the pin event and someone's got to win those before the pin event so those are some chocolates in a lovely box it's a tin saying Universal Studios Japan and that was 1,600 yen so about 14, 15 dollars so about 11 pounds so that's that look at the bags that they sell things in look you've got Hello Kitty there and you got Snoopy that side. There was a Snoopy shop. What we got next? 
right. Oh, this is marvellous. On the little charm itself, it's got Universal Studios Japan. And then on this side, it's Wizarding World of Harry Potter. And then you've got your little bag charm, your wand, so I can do some conjuring. And that's actually going to go on my Harry Potter backpack, which I don't know if I've uploaded that whole video. That's another whole video I've got to do. Um, and it's rubber, so it won't break. So, yeah, I love that. Love, love, love that. Oh, and that was, how much was that, Karen? I forgot. Um, and that was 1,800 yen, so probably about 15, 16 dollars. So about 12, 13 pounds. But I like it because it's rubber. So I just thought that was a fabulous bag charm, something I've not seen before. Key rings, I've got more key rings for the kids. Will she like this one? She didn't want the Dumbo one. Will she like this one? If not, this will be in the giveaway. Look, oh, honey jukes, it's honey jukes. It's the jellies. Will it go into frame? There you go. It's all the, the jelly beans from Honey Jukes. Isn't that fab? And it's every flavour beans. And that's a little key ring there. Oh, I just thought it was really lovely. And that one was 1800 yen, so about $16, so about £12. But I hadn't seen those before. I thought that was lovely. That's meant for Sav. So if she says, Mom, I don't want it, that'll be in the giveaway. She's like that, my daughter. She is, she's like that. Then, have I got another one? What have I just done with the other one? What's that one? So much stuff on the table. Everything is easily lost. Ah, oh, it's in here. Ah, oh, this little one. Blake is gonna love this. He's gonna love this. He loves chocolate frogs. He does. It's a chocolate frog key ring. But here's the thing, it smells like chocolate. It's, it's, it's amazing, it's rubber and it smells like chocolate. And that was 1300 yen. So that's about, I don't know, 11, 12 dollars and uh, about nine, eight, nine pounds. So that's fabulous, I love that. It smells like really, really milky chocolate. <laughs> I love that. You know, it's really hard when your kids are teenagers. Um, adults. Once you buy them when you go to the theme parks, um, Savannah's really funny about what t-shirts she'd wear. Same with Blake and so I give up. And then oh, I got these for the giveaway. I got some butterbeer sweets. Look butterbeer! Aren't these fab? And these were 1200 yen so that's about ten dollars about seven pounds but they're actually little butterbeer sweets and it's in a tin so that's going into the giveaway as well um those are those, those. that's a bag oh yes and then the last thing i got from universal studios was another thing that i'm going to put into a giveaway so i'm not going to open it because it's sealed but it's 2500 yen so about 22 dollars about 17 pound but it's a wand ballpoint pen can you see that it's not focusing on me, is it? There you go. How fab is that? I hadn't seen those before either. So when I saw that, I was like, we've got to get that. Um, and on the back, it tells you it's from Universal Studios Japan. Um, and obviously I had the biscuits and the chocolates from, from earlier on in a different haul, my taste testing haul. But that was everything I got from Universal. So not a huge haul from Universal but still some fabulous items and items ready for when I start doing some Japanese giveaways. But I hope you've enjoyed that. Thanks for watching. Don't forget, if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button, comment on the link at the end of the video, and also the notification bell. That way then you'll always know when I've uploaded a video and it's your choice if you want to watch it or not. Um, we've got some fabulous Tokyo Tuesday videos coming up. We've got all of the holiday vlogs to start the trip vlogs. I've got the popcorn one. I've got how to get to Universal from Disneyland. And we just had so much fun. So, so, so much fun. Um, so thank you. Thanks so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed this. I'll see you really soon. See you next Tuesday, if not before, for another Tokyo Tuesday. Be good, be kind, take care of yourselves, and I'll see you then. Bye, everyone. Bye. Bye.